What's up, everybody? It's me, Alex Childs, aka Brother Childs, aka Heem. Reginald Vale Johnson, representing Brothers United, checking in. And uh, <clears throat> up here watching Martin. Bam. You know, old school Martin, so I can see it. And uh, got me, I just got in actually. Uh, got me my dinner. I got five beef and pork burritos, lean with the guacamole sauce and the the hot sauce on there with the whole grain uh, tortilla wraps. Hella good. Anyway, uh, I got a question today. I'm very happy about this. Uh, it's a friend of mine. Uh, shout out to Sir Say G. She like family though, but she's just curious. So I had the thing up, the little channel up, so she wants some advice. She wants to know how can she reduce uh, fat in her arm. Okay, now this is basically a spot reduction question. She wants to know how she can do that. Can you reduce fat in your arm? Yes and no. Yes, you can reduce fat in your arm. Can you reduce fat in your arm only? No, you cannot. There is no such thing as spot reduction. All right. If you're going to drop fat, you're going to drop fat everywhere. It's not just going to be your arms. So to solve this problem, you can do, uh, I'm going to try and keep this quick because I want to eat too. I'm trying to get down. You feel me? Uh, you can do a couple things. Uh, set a caloric deficit. Okay. You should be... Whenever you go to the gym, you should be burning more calories than you take in. All right. So I don't know how much I don't know how much she weighs, but for example, uh, we use me for an example. For example, I'm 232 pounds. Uh, it's kind of hard to use me right now because I'm not cutting. But um, let's go for example. I don't know. 150 some odd pound athlete whatever uh, he's burning a significant amount of calories he may be taking in 2,000 calories a day maybe a little bit more maybe 2,000 to 2,500 calories a day he goes out exercises maybe he burns 3,000 maybe he burns 3,000 calories to 4,000 calories depending on what exercise he does he's dropping weight okay he's cutting that's one way to do it Check your caloric deficit. <laughs> uh, take in less calories and then burn more. Okay, you have to take in less, burn more. All right. How to achieve that? Exercise. It's that simple. Now, since we're talking about the arms, um, arm exercises, tone them up. Uh, tricep exercise, shoulder exercise, bicep exercises, curls, tricep pull downs. Um, Shoulder press, these types of exercises, fringe dips, dips, machine dips. Uh, if you're not strong on, um, if your triceps aren't strong yet, do a, di a dip assist. I'm sure m most gyms have dip assist machines. Uh, that's a machine, it's got the little bar on the bottom, you can stand on it, pop yourself up, hit your dips. Do those. Uh, high reps, you want to get toned up, all right? Um, Lightweight, don't overdo the weight if it's your first time. Just, you know, it's, you ain't gonna get super cut instantly, all right? Um, arm exercises, but keep in mind if you're gonna hit, if you're on, this is basically a diet, a caloric deficit, all right? Caloric surplus, I don't know how much you weigh, but you shouldn't be taking in. You should be taking in no more, in my opinion, no more. So you, you are, it is a woman, so no more in 2,500 to 3,000 calories, all right? No more than that. Roughly around there, okay? Roughly, I'm just, I'm guesstimating, all right? You have to burn more calories than you take in, all right? That's number one. Number two, you have to hit arm exercises. Do compound lifts, okay? Um, do deadlifts, do uh, with dumbbells, you know what I'm saying? All these exercises are going to contribute to you cutting. I mean, you're not just going to work your arms, you're going to hit other, bo uh, other body parts, okay? Um, also, let me touch on this, all right? I'm also going to touch on this a little bit more on another episode, but 
if you go to Target, you go to Walmart, wherever, I don't know, wherever you, you want to shop, and you see the little waist pads, this is more hidden, this is more hidden your abs, all right, your, your lower area. you like, ooh, look at that girl. She got the little waist around there. She must be sweating right around in her ab area or her stomach area. I want abs. That's going to give me abs. What I'm talking about is a waist belt. It helps you sweat. Does this work? Yes and no. Okay? You will sweat. All right? You're sweating water weight. All right? But you're sweating everywhere. Of course, you're going to have to drink more water, so you're going to gain it back. That's the way it is. All right? There's no such thing as spot reduction. So it may, I don't know if they have these. I haven't searched them out because I don't, I, don't, I don't buy these things. But if you maybe go to Target or wherever online and it says is a, a, a pad for your arm, lose weight around your arm, you're like, ooh, it costs $18, $20. You just wasted $18 and $20. Yes, you're going to sweat around your arm. Yes, you will lose weight around your arm, but it's water weight, okay? It's not going to burn. It's not going to burn the fat that you need to burn, okay? The, the fat's going to, it's going to be there. You're just burning water weight, okay? And who the heck sweats out of their arm crazy like that, all right? That's just, that's just the way I see it, all right? Don't waste your money on those things. I'm trying to save you a few bucks. Don't waste your money on any spot reduction, um, any spot reduction paraphernalia, I guess you could call it, all right? It's not going to work. Burn more calories than you take in, you're going to burn everywhere, not just your arm. Two, hit arm exercises. That's simple, all right? Uh, it's a simple, simple question, nothing too crazy, but that's okay, though. I appreciate it, and I welcome more questions like that. I'm finna get on my, bam, my five burritos, hella juicy. They look like they not good, but, you know, they got hella juice on them, but they good, all right? Trust me, I, I, I am killing the burritos, please believe Anyway, in closing, this is your boy, Alex Childs, a.k.a. Brother Childs, a.k.a. Heem. Reginald Vale Johnson. Representing Brothers United. Checking out. I'll get y'all at the next one.